YouTube, back here once again. Uh, maybe you can see me. Uh, bringing a video to you uh, that's long past due. Uh, there's a lot of people that has complained about the Bofang BF230. I'll see the radio real quick. This radio here. Um, if you buy them, they tell you that they are chirp supported. No, they are not. Chirp does not even offer this radio none whatsoever. Or remarkably close. But anyway, after several months of research, I uh, paid $22 for them. I think I was an idiot for doing it at the time, but now no. <coughs> not once I found out. It is a uh, UHF radio. Uh, but we're going to show you something. Well, make a long story short which we got 20 minutes so we can do whatever um, I've done quite a bit of research I've tried chirp I have done several several uh, programmings everybody says to use this one and use different ones and try different ones and none of them ever work of course they never do uh, one guy's tried telling me to do uh, the uh, BFT8 turn the volume halfway up it didn't work of course not everything says the same thing cannot commute with radio radio not supported well alright you two we gonna solve that today um, if you like the video give it a thumbs up uh, bring this video to all my subscribers and uh, viewers um, Spread the video around that way, people it can help people out to get the software to do the radio. Um, let's get on with the video. Okay, first thing we'll do, I'm in my coffee here, is go to your Google bar and type in Bofang BF480 Plus. Programming software. Type it in like it right there. Hold it there for a minute. That way you can see it. One more time. And whenever it comes up, you'll see all this. Kind of scoop like a little bit. And the very first one right there. That one right there. Is the one you want to click up on. Let me get a little closer. That way you can see it. You know for a fact. Home Home Bofang website. Bofangradio.com. See if I can get all that in there where you can see it. Okay. Click on it. You'll see it come up this page here. It'll say both things. Alright, you'll see different ones. They use the BF480. Don't get that one. You want the plus. Once I find it. Alright, right there. The one that you see that's highlighted. 480 plus setup. I do believe that's the one, so let's download it just to make sure. Like I said, I can always go back into the computer system, delete it, and be done with it. It's 2.2 megabytes. See? That way you can see it, downloading it. Okay. Trying to get the camera to adjust. Go over here to open. I use a uh, energize a thing called Rare Opener. Uh, to me, it makes things a little simpler to open. Uh, mine I always push desktop. Let it do its little scan. It'll come up. It'll say success. Get out of the way. Hit success. Uh, 
Okay. You got three different ones here. Alright, let's see. get up here close. Look at the camera to focus. You see that right there? BF four eight oh plus dash CPS. You can get you set up, set up. I'll tell you here in just a minute for sure if this is the correct one. Because I've already got it downloaded on my computer. You gotta push extract. Yep, that's the right one. Cause it's coming up. See, so once you get it already in the system, it'll come up this right here. Copy and replace. So that's how I know that's the correct one cause I've already got it in the computer. So I'll just go ahead and replace it. It ain't gonna hurt nothing. Just remember, Bofang BF four four eight zero plus. Go to the Bofang uh, home Bofang website. Push negative, minimize. I mean, remember, come up on this screen right here. Go down to right there. 480 plus setup. Go over to the far right, download it. Says my wife back there smacking flies. Alright, when it's done. It'll come up with a logo just like it right there. BF480 Plus. It'll have a little radio. Just click on that one. Let the camera focus there. And here's what it comes up. It's 16 channel. That's all it is. Alright YouTube, hold on. I'm going to pause the video and hook the radio up. Okay, YouTube, uh, I've got the radio plugged into the computer. Uh, you see the wire here, the USB cable. I'm pretty sure that people got them. All right, first thing you want to do, this is the only downfall to it. it, everything comes up with a bunch of question marks. One of them, right there. Hit the English, then it changes everything to where you can read it. And make sure you see everything. All right, let's read from radio. I'm gonna set the camera down here. Maybe you can see it. No, you can't see it. Read from radio. If it'll give you a little bit of trouble, you'll just have to work with it. Uh, set the communication port to three. Confirm it'll say right there communication. Mine's three. Uh, now one of my other radios I have it is particular and it says five but it's not really five but that's what it wants. Push read from radio. It'll say it'll come up and say connecting to receiver. Sometimes it'll read it the first time sometimes it will not. It likes to argue with each other, but it will come up. You see it. That is a successful download of the Bofang BF230 right there. Make sure you turn your volume all the way up. All right, just show you, let's see, come up to the model here. If you want to turn this radio into a VHF, if you want to turn it into a UHF, 
or if you want to turn it into full which I got this one as a full uh, band 100 megahertz to 601 megahertz and it is possible because I've already done it confirm if you look right there top left hand corner that is a VHF frequency right there because it's a 155 number now if you look right below it it is a UHF frequency 460 so you see it I downloaded the radio I didn't program the radio I didn't write it to the radio but uh, let's see here let's just change that frequency right there Yes, here. One, five, five. Trying to think of one here. Point, five, six, seven. What does do that? Just to show you. Enter, enter, enter. Leave all that the same. Go up here to where it says read, write. Right to radio. Like I said, leave it on. Go, go up there, to model. Bring it down to where it says UH, VHF, UHF, or full. I put it on full. That way, I can make it a multiband. Push right to radio. You seen me type the frequency in? Like I said, it, they will argue with each other. There it goes. You seen it, write it. It worked. Uh, leave your comments below. Uh, if you need any help, just leave a comment in the comment section. Uh, I'll put a link to the radio in the description on Amazon if you want to buy some. Uh, I'm not selling them. You can't have mine. So, just leave a comment in the video. If you need any help, I'll get back with you. I'll do my best. I'll tell you exactly how to go through it again. So, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Have a good one.